Many adults believe that the youth of this country are politically insignificant. But actually, we have moved mountains and led revolution. Our voices have had an impact throughout our nation's history right up to today. Young voters continually reshape our society with new ideas, new passions, new priorities. In every generation, young people like us have led important movements, powered by unstoppable energy and hunger for change. Ever heard of George Washington Albright? An enslaved 15-year-old under a cover of darkness in Civil War Mississippi secretly spread news of emancipation between plantations. What about the young couple in Indiana, Maddie Thomas and Uriah Oblinger? Even though Uriah joined the Union Cavalry and fought in the Civil War, it was his girlfriend Maddie who persuaded him to vote for the candidate she preferred at a time when women were denied the right to vote themselves. And then there's Emma Teneyukin. At 16 years old, she led protests and organized strikes for workers' rights in the Southwest during the 1930s. We were even involved in the founding of our democracy. Surprised? Alexander Hamilton was in his late teens when he started attending meetings and writing political papers leading up to the American Revolution. The ideas of freedom and equality for truly everyone took years, centuries, to fully develop. And who was at the cutting edge of these movements, pushing to be heard by their elders and elites? We were. We flooded the streets with midnight campaign rallies in the 1800s. Occupied segregated lunch counters and college campuses in the 1960s. And filled social media and the National Mall with our voices. We are part of something bigger than ourselves. Throughout our country's history, young people from all backgrounds have shaped our elections, our, our society, society, and, and our, our democracy. democracy. And now and it's our turn. Today, Today we, we vote. vote. We pay attention. We, we influence. influence advocate and organize. It's our history, our lives, our, our future. And it starts with each one of us taking action on the issues we care about. We are a generation of many individual voices. And these ideas and actions matter. So what, what will, will you, you stand, stand for? for?